Wait, I can sell Skooma to my own dog. Get lost fa- <laughs> What's going on? This is insanity. I've had too much Skooma. I've smoked too much Skooma, friends. My own dog. Right, my friends, welcome to the next episode of Skyrim Life as a Skooma dealer. Now, if you remember in the last episode, we journeyed across Solstheim looking, well, looking for these guys, these reavers that we found at the end of the episode here. Uh, while we were traveling across, we sold many vials of skooma, a lot of double distilled and a lot of soothing skooma. We also ran into some uh, Morog Tong, very unfriendly dudes trying to kill us. They killed our reavers as well, but we managed to survive and so did our dog here who's uh, following us. I, I can't seem to get rid of him, so I think he's with us forever now by the looks of it. And so, yeah, we've sold pretty much to every reaver here, so we need to head away for a while let these guys, you know, enjoy their skooma. We'll come back with more supply, because uh, we do need to supply it anyway. We've sold most of our skooma now, so we need to go back to our lab. We need to brew some more. We need to get some soothing skooma and some double distilled skooma, because, man, they sold so well last episode. I think those two, to the Reavers, is, is just easy coinage in our pocket. But before I go back to the lab, there's some things I need to do in Solstheim first. Namely, I want to pick up some more Reavers at that weird parasite cave location because they're kind of nomads right now. And then I will uh, go sell these pendants to that innkeeper guy, all those uh, East Empire pendants that I've been picking up along the way. So let's first go to the Reavers that are without without house or home. Uh, and I believe it was... I believe it was this here, you know. So let's try going here. Yes, it was indeed here. It was these fellas here. So if we drink bring these guys along. We'll make, maybe we'll drop them off the, the ship. Uh, I'm not going to bring them with me because we know that too many of my reavers have died previously. But I would like them as customers. So if we bring them with us, we'll drop them off at the reaver ship. And then we'll uh, head back to the lab. Get some more skooma going. Should I see if we can sell to these guys right now, actually? Got some skooma. You interested? Come on. Not interested. That's a shame. What are you, friend? Come on. You, you're going to want some. My crime is being reported. These reavers like report my crime for some reason. Yes. Excuse me, I've got some uh, double distilled. Yeah, I've got two bottles left. Let's move, try and move these. Oh, he will pass. I guess we're not moving it. Well, we can always enjoy them ourselves, I think. We, we, it's been a while since we've uh, consumed some skooma. Let's get these guys to the ship first, yeah. and then we'll uh, maybe treat ourselves to some skooma. Right, friends, are you coming with me now? The last three of you? Because um, the other friends that I took... <laughs> The other two friends that came with me have died already, I'm afraid. I will promise the fate will not be the same for you. I'm taking you home. I'm so sorry that you had to lose your, your base here, but I'm taking you somewhere safe, somewhere new with more Reaver friends. So let's go to the good old sunken ship. So here it is. Let's go. Well, here it is, friends. It's not much, but it's uh, one of the safer places here in Solstheim, and there are many friends for you to, uh, to sit by the fire with. Enjoy. I'm sure you can set up some some bed rolls down here somewhere. There's plenty. Right. Come in, come in, friends, come in. Here they are. I will let them all relax. Here. That's right, friends. Enjoy your stay here. Oh, look, he's already getting to work mining this heartstone deposit. That's pretty cool. Right. Well, I think we'll stay here the night, and then come morning we'll uh, head into Raven Rock and try and sell those pendants. I wonder if these guys want, want to buy some skew at the minute. And what might you need? Oh yes! Look at this. Ah, oh, hello to my favourite customer. How are we today? Well, the divine is good to see you. Please, I need skewer, please. So I've actually got these guys all addicted now, so I can sell them regular skewer for three hundred a piece now. So actually, thank uh, thanks to all the commenters actually who mentioned that because I totally missed that dialogue option the next episode. I hadn't realised that I've got these uh, these reavers here addicted to my product. That no, that was a dialogue option, so it's very cool actually that uh, that's a yes, thing in the uh, game. And uh, for some reason, I just I just missed it. And uh, yeah, so thanks for letting me know about that. Let's try it again because I saw the option again. Yes, sir. How are we today? I don't need more now. Okay. Right. What about this this fella here? I still got some double distilled. Got some skewing. You interested? Let me call the guards. You might like it. There we are. See, we still got, we still got a decent amount of regular skooma, I think, to sell. Let's see how much we've got. We've got 14 skooma still, so if we can actually sell this regular skooma, that'd be good for us. Because uh, we've got to get rid of that. Uh, are you interested in some skooma? Not interested. That is a shame. Right. Speaking of skooma, I think it's time I, I took something myself. What have I got in my pockets here? I've got something that's nice. I'm warming my hands up here by the fire. That's very nice. Right, I've got a bottle of... 
I've got various things. I've got a red water scooper, which I don't really want to take. Because that stuff can be pretty lethal. I've got a sleeping tree sap, but I'm going to sell that to wood elves only, because they can give me a lot of money for that. I've got some unrefined moon sugar, which is not really great. I've got some hist sap. Ooh. That's like toad venom, right? It's got to be similar to toad venom. Psychedelic. Let's take it. Let's see what it does to us. Enjoy a bottle of hist sap here and there. Oh. Uh-oh. Okay, that hit, that hit, that hiss sap has hit me hard, bros. Uh-oh. Okay, um... Okay. Oh yeah, all these reavers are addicted to themselves now. We're look, look at this, this is gonna become a skooma addict camp. Let's close these gates. Got some more. I heard someone asking for skooma here. Come on, friends. Come on. You know you want the good stuff. I've got some very potent red water. Oh yes, this guy brought the red water. Very good, very good. Enjoy it, friend. Enjoy it. This hiss sap's actually hit me pretty hard. Uh oh, what's going on? Right, I need to lay down a bit. I'm gonna go into the ship and lay my weary head until morning. Cause oh my, <laughs> this hiss sap's hit me hard, bros. What's going on? Look at this. Uh oh, the further away I get, the the more double things are as I approach them. Uh oh. Oh. This life is not... Why have I done this to myself? Hiss sap, skooma, green moat, Daryl, I've, I've taken it all. Look at this, it's crazy. Right, we're gonna have to sleep this off if I can actually make my way down deck. Is this it down here? I think it is. Can't see a thing. Oh, I wonder if, since I'm very good friends with this guy, I wonder if he'll let me take his bed. I'm sure he will. Yeah, let's sleep here. No, we had a good few hours there. It's not quite enough. Oh, there it is. Okay, it just worn off there. Uh, Reaver Outlaw, who are you? Why are you in here? This is the captain's quarters. Right, let's make our way back to Raven Rock then. And get these pendants sold for even more coin. Then it's back to the lab. To make more skooma, but also... Oh, who's this? Reaver Thug, just a random Reaver Thug, huh? Uh, also, in this episode, I want to head to the, the lab... Or the den that's just outside Riften that I found out about in Life as a Beggar episode 6. I didn't even know that was a thing, but there is a skooma lab just outside Riften, near our lab. And uh, we should go with our, with our bandit gear on and uh, check it out. We might find some friends there and some product that we can sell. So, we've got a lot planned this episode. Right, we're fast approaching the city walls. I'm going to go to that stash that I set up here to see if I've got anything left behind. Before I leave, no, the hunter's cache is definitely empty. Good, just making sure. Right, I believe the guy in the inn, is it? I think he buys the pendants. If not, I'll have to look it up, but I'm pretty certain someone mentioned it was the the innkeep here buys the pendants. So if we go to the inn, I think it's, is it here? Yes, it is. All right, here we are. And uh, who's this fellow running up to us? I work you okay? Mogul. You got a problem, you talk. Why is this guy running up to me in that, in that manner? Right, friend, please buy my things. To the Netch corner below oh. Sujama, Who are you? What are you doing? Patrons, <laughs> Dude, stop pushing me around. What is this guy doing? What's he playing at? Right, I have no interest in your stories, guy. I want to sell you some pendants. Well, I could spread the word for your Sujama. There we are. Very cool. I don't think that guy is the guy who buys the... Uh, Dependence though, because I've got, I've got to get out of there. I don't want to waste time with this guy, so I might have to look up actually who sells the who I can sell the pendants to. Well, we've got some free Sujama. We are Sujama salesmen as well now. Try this new drink, friend. Oh, okay. This guy thinks it's swill. We'll do that later. I'm not going to run around selling Sujama because I've got a actual skooma to sell. So. Back to the lab we go. Friend, I need passage Speaking once passage more. Windhelms, Actually, maybe this guy wants to try the drink. Than Dark Elf oh, there we are. Like that works. <laughs> Got to sell nine more. wonder if we can sell that in Skyrim. Bring people over to Solstein. Right, like passage back, please. As soon as yes, of course. This guy, always always questioning my coin. Oh, yeah, back to the cold, hard docks of uh, Windhelm. Luckily, I've got my, my nice cloak on. All these guys. Who's this dude? This guy looks pretty cool. Sorry, Hello there. You don't know what freedom really You're the ship captain? You look oh, very cool. You make an example of that gang. Oh, you want to deal uh, with a gang? Uh, yeah, not interested, coward. friend. Yeah, I'm definitely a coward. There's, there's no... I wasn't saying otherwise. I have no interest in dealing with your... Your bandit problem. 
Right then, let's make our way back to the lab, shall we? Very nice. Good old Golden Glow Estate we go. Oh yeah, we've got a couple more Reavers still here, haven't we? All that one Reaver. Alright, to Golden Glow we go. Right then, we're going to have a lot of coin to give to our partner, because last episode we sold so much skooma. I, I, I'm dreading to think about how big this guy's cut's going to be of our precious coin, but... He is our partner after all, and he did provide us with a soothing skooma. We didn't actually make that ourselves, so I guess he is kind of deserving of the cut, but... Well, I'm not. I'm none too happy about how big his cut still is, even after dealing with uh, Gullum Eye, who was supposedly taking up half our cut. Right, here's the good old lab entrance. Wild Companion, please step aside. Does anyone know how to get rid of these Wild Companions? Because I can't for the life of me get rid of this guy, and he teleports everywhere with me, barking constantly. Right, here's your cut, friend. Come take it. Come on. Wait, is he not even... Oh, there he is. Okay. How much do you sell? I have sold a bunch of vials. I did indeed. Here's your cut. 4,500, man. I think we sold a bit more than that. It's been a pleasure to do so far. Let's get back to cooking. Uh, dot, dot, dot. What? Cooked a batch. Yes, more soothing. Yes. Indeed, it will fetch a good price. Uh, what do you think? How is our operation faring? I mean, street level wise? Uh, yes. You're moving mad volume. Skyrim is in our grip. And the underworld respects us. Yes. Brilliant. That's what I want to hear. Okay, anything else? The underworld respects us. What else? Is there anything new? I guess not. Huh, maybe maybe the quest line for this skooma den is over now. Because uh, he's not given us any more tasks to do in a while. So I wonder if we just need to sell even more, maybe? Because the underworld respects us. Like what, what, what above that do we have to do? But he gave us some more soothing skooma, which is what we need. We also need some more... Um... Southern Guard Sky Blue? What? Cook a vial of Southern Guard Sky Blue. That quest just begun. Look at this, Southern Guard Sky Blue. Blue Mountain Flower. Purified Moon Sugar. Balmora Blue. So you need a Balmora Blue into that itself. Ice Wraith Essence. Empty Skimmer Bottle. So we've got the Frost Salts. We need Blue Mountain Flower. Purified Moon Sugar. Balmora Blue. So, oh my. Oh my indeed. So this is the... As I was saying, there's no new quests. We have got Southern, uh, Southern Guard Sky Blue, which is... What if I added a bit of Ice Wraith Essence, Frost Salts, Blue Mountain Flowers, and Purified Moon Shots with the Balmora Blue? That should create a much more potent and purer version of Skooma. Is this like the, this is the end game, bros? We're in the end game here. By, by the gods. So we need to make some Balmora Blue then, which we need some Black Briar Reserve for that. Right. This won't be too hard. I think we'll go check out the lab... The, the opposing lab outside Riften first, and then we'll come back and focus on making that sky blue. I didn't even know that was a thing. I'm very excited now, my friends. Let's head out, because this is exciting stuff. Right, let's do this. Right, okay, I'm going to bring... Actually, I don't want to bring the Reaver with me, because he's so low health. I need to actually heal him. Maybe I should bring Mercurio with me, but I like him You're guarding this place. Right. His eye is still... Look at that. Mercurio just never got that fixed. I think with my bandit gear on, if I've actually got it on, I should be safe in the lab. I think it's bandit controlled, if I remember from the beggar episode. Yeah, bandit gear. So, I believe the lab was just over that way. So let's take the boat to the outside of Riften, and then uh, go from there. Right, since we have the respect of the underworld, these guys shouldn't attack us. Oh, there's a mountain flower there. Let's pick that up, actually. Because we need that for the um, sky blue. Brilliant. Fantastic. Right, I believe this is literally the lab there. So we should... Or the den, sorry. So I think, you know... Our part, oh, there's a bear. Let's deal with this guy. Bear, where did you go? I'll not be threatened by creatures of the forest. Come out, there you are. That's it, you better run. Yeah, that's it, bear. I've dealt with worse than you. That's it. Do <laughs> My dog is chasing him. Please don't die, dog. Wait, what's all those what's all those dots? Wait, what's going on? Okay. How many bears are there? What is going on? I'm not getting down from here. This is this is <laughs> there's a, a giant group of bear. One's got Oh, what's going on? What on earth is that? Oh, it's a Spriggan. A Spriggan's controlling them. That's what's going on. A Spriggan Earth Mother. Oh god, I don't even know how to deal with this. Right, if I just go hidden, I'm hoping that they will go away. No, they're coming back to me now. 
Yeah, there's a saber cat. There's everything down here. Look at this. Oh, word. We get the earth mo mother. That might kill the rest of them. So you flee, coward. Oh, I just slipped. Uh oh, no. They're coming for us. Look at them. They're coming for us. You stay away. Okay, you better look at this earth mother. I've got some stronger arrows upon me. Once I kill her, I'm, I'm sure her bears will be felled. Why? What is, I just want to go to a, a skooma den. I don't want to deal with this. I've got a staff of spark that might go handy. There we go. How'd you like that? How'd you like being tased, huh? You don't like it much, do you? Oh, you take that. oh, she's just draining my health completely. What is going on there? Like, just when I need guards is when they don't hang around. Oh, let's run down here. Let's get help from these guys down here. Help me, friends. Help me. I beg you, this Earth Mother is killing me. <laughs> Uh-oh. I don't think we'll find help down here. Someone just got burnt to death. Actually, maybe they will. But yes. Who are you? Yes, a bandit. Yes. The underworld knows me as their great skooma dealer. Mercenary Warrior just got killed here. There we are. Take that, Earth Mother. That's it. You're dealing with bandits now. Look at, oh, look at that! Fire! I guess it's the great week. No, look at that. Dealt with swiftly by this. Look at this dude. Yes, thank you, friend. You saved me. Yes, Adult Junkie. I can sell to you. Perhaps. Can I sell to you, Adult Junkie? Maybe when you're out of combat? But that dealt with the uh, our main problem there. Spriggan Earth Mother. Spriggan Sap. Take your arrows. I guess it is, friends. You you helped me greatly there. I rem remember this place. Filled with very tough bandits. They killed a mercenary warrior. Did this mercenary warrior come alone to attack this bandit fortress? Did he think he would just take them on by himself and win? But there is an adult junkie here that we can Need use something? to sell skooma to. Thank you, friend. My skooming days lie behind me. What? You're an adult junkie. You might like it. There we are. <laughs> that worked. That worked very nicely. What of you, friend? Got some skewmy if you're interested. Get lost, fence. Okay, and yes. what of you? Right, well, this is a cool little place. A couple of Oh, look at this. Yeah, good few bandits. Oh, there's many bandits here. Hello, how about you, friend? You want some skewmy? Let's leave this area now. Go back to the, the good old den. And actually go inside this time without being killed. Oh, yes, more mountain flowers. That's, this is exactly what we need for the Cyrodiilic Sky Blue. I'm so excited to make this. Right, we're coming back. Oh, the bear's still alive. Oh, looks of it. I think I can take this one by myself, though. Right, bear, you take that. Oh, there are yet more bears still. Okay, so it's not over then, is it? Let's uh, go back to our bandit friend, shall we? If I bring the bears along. That's it, you follow me, bears. That's it, you follow me to your, your deaths. Come on. That's it. That's it, you get a few scratches on me before you die. Bandits. I need you once more. Your, your skooma dealer needs you. That's it. Get him archers. I don't let the archers do this. Look at that. And these bandits are tough, guys. Yes! Being felled very nicely. Well done. Well done. Thank you, friend. The archer on the wall there. Now, hopefully we can actually go back. To where, unless there's another group of bears that I forgot about. <laughs> let me grab a sword just in case. Got my skimitar by my side here. My gem on the on the end there, on the hilt. Saber cat, another bear. Right, that's it. Game over for the bears. Now we enter the dealer's den. This is it, friends. Let's enter these doors. At this point, word has definitely reached the underworld, according to our partner. And uh, most bandits and dealers will know, know us by our face and name. So I expect we shall be offered safe passage to through this den. I guess I'm still gonna have to pick this lock though, by the looks of it. Luckily, it's only a novice lock. And there we are. Thought I was gonna break the lock pick there. Right, what have we got down here? I remember there being some good, mighty stuff down here. Let's search every barrel because this is a dealer's den. It might have. There we are, like moon sugar just in the barrel. So we should definitely search these barrels. Uh, take what we can. And yes, look at this moon sugar. We take this before being seen. I'm... Oh! <laughs> Uh, sorry, friend. I need your moon sugar. I thank you for, for for lending me some because uh, I can I can offer you many potent many potent skewers for your trouble. 
Right, this place looks pretty cool. So it's bandit controlled. I guess they're the guards. Wonder if we'll find the dealer down downstairs somewhere. Steel battle axe, stuff like that. Cool. Let's search this chest. It's locked adept. Right, there we are. Nicely done. What have we got in here? Yes, we've got the Daryl. This is the good stuff that we wanted. That's our own personal stash right there. Some skooma. Won't go amiss at all. Well, let's delve deeper into the dealer's den, shall we? have got a bandit archer. It's good to know we've got more friends down here if we need them. And a bandit dick. Oh my, what what kind of bandit is this? Yes, sir. Would you like some skooma? Not interested. Uh, maybe these guys don't take the product. They only guard it. That would make sense. I admire that at the very least. And uh, just more skooma lying around. Just free skooma lying around. Man, episode one. I could have used this if I knew about this. There's a hawker tusk as well. Can I get this vial? I don't think I can actually get that one. Come on, I want to get that bottle there. Die already, so I can take. I guess stuff. I can't. All right, I've got a nice fire there. Let's search these barrels. We've got some garlic. And uh, oh, another chest here. What might you need? Stripped mm. items, locked expert. We've got enough lockpicks to give it a go. Oh, nearly. Ah, oh, so close. There we are. Nice. We've got some iron armor. Oh, look at 44 lockpicks. Unrefined moon sugar. Nothing else much uh, that we currently need right now. Right then, let's delve deeper. What's my carry looking like? It's looking okay for now. I can't be lifting too much armor and stuff. But there, it looks like this place is filled to the brim with bandits. Yes. Huh, just like the Reavers and Solstein, maybe we can start selling to these guys yes. and develop a kind of little relationship here. Look at, all these, look at these iron ingots. Now this place is vast and epic. What's down here? What have we got down here? We've got a steel shot rookie. Peaky. Chest. These are their personal chests. You I don't really, really want to rob from the, these. Even though they might have good stuff in. There's another chest there. Guild chest. Wait, can I... Is this some kind of guild? What is this? What even is this place? Is this somewhere that I can run eventually? Like, I actually don't know what this place is. But there's a bear pelt there. Right, I'm just so excited. Let's go even deeper into this place, shall we? Wait, did I miss anything? Okay, no, I didn't. Let's go deeper. Let's go deeper into this dealer's den. Man, I'm so excited. There is something down this way. It is locked adept. And there's something down this way, which is not locked. Let's go to here first, shall we? Oh, it's a... Oh, it's a it's a personal quarters. Who's this? Ask oh, the bandit chief. Friend, would you like some skooma? I am the, the master of skooma, after all. I have got some double distilled. They are too potent. Ah, oh, friend, I'm sorry. I'll be taking these skoomas, though. Nightshade as well, that comes in handy. I can't... Oh, wait, these bottles are, like, not actually takeable. That's a shame. Moon sugar. Right, so this is, like, the chief, then. He, the chief lives here. I'm not going to take too much of his stuff, but these potions will always come in handy. Soul gem and things. Right. Nord Warhorn. What on earth can you do with this? Is that even a thing you can use? This might be used in... I think this is just used in crafting only. But, oh, Balmora Blue, right there. We don't even need to brew it now for the Cyrodiil Sky Blue. Yes, this is what we were after. This is why we came down here, so we get the product without actually having to make it ourselves. There we are, just a free bottle of Balmora Blue. That's way more valuable than the gold ingot. Let's leave that. But, um, yes, the Balmora Blue. Actually, I'm going to take that gold ingot, actually, because it's worth a hundy. Let's take that. Something. Right, brilliant. I'm so glad we came down here, because we've got that bottle of Balmora Blue now, which means we're nearly at the end of our uh, ingredients for the Cyrodiilux Sky Blue. We just need to make some refined moon sugar, which we have plenty of moon sugar to do that with. So, uh, yeah, this place is just spilling with ingredients and, and skooma and all sorts. I'm so happy. So happy. Ebony dagger, wardrobe. Let's go deeper then. Actually, let's go across here first. See what's in here. Right, come on. I hear some howling. I think there's some wolves down here. Yes, there is. Oh, there's a saber cat just loose. Chief. Bandit chief. I need your help, friend. There is indeed a saber cat here who is who's loose in the chamber. But my dog seems to be dealing with it pretty swiftly, actually. <laughs> yeah, look at that. They've, my dog nearly killed it already. I'll finish it up, I guess. There we are. Oh, I think I just got diseased there. That's not good. What have I got? What have I caught there? Bone break fever. Oh, and Whitbane. Let's, uh, let's do a cure disease, shall we? A little little cure disease potion. No, we got three of them. I think that'll work. And yeah, that works very nicely. What's down here, then? 
We've got some unrefined moon sugar, some great swords and things. Oh, it looks like there's a, some prisoners down here. My word. Okay, they've got some wolves trapped. I want to leave him there. I have no interest in unleashing that beast. But it looks like, yeah, they're just a little cage. It looks like they've got a lot of things going on down here. Um, wait, more lockpicks, more moon sugar. They've got they've got skooma trade going on. They've got pit fighting and prisoners and things. What, what on earth is going on down here? Let's go deeper then, shall we? And oh my! This place is so vast and filled with bandits. Look at this. Look at this place. Hello there. Novice conjurer. Look at these bottles of skooma. Uh, uh, essence of sleeping tree. By the gods. They've got a better lab setup than even we have. My what? Whoa. Whoa. Look at this dude. This this guy might even be a match for Regal Strongarm. Look how giant this guy is. Kettle, skooma, empty. Look at this. Brewing. Oh, they're doing the, the crushed diamond method. Very good for crystallizing the moon sugar. Need something? Essence of sleeping tree. How much have they got? This is vast, and I'm glad I know these guys now. Who, who runs this joint, then? Is it this guy? Can I speak to that guy, do you, do you think? I'm not going to take too much, because actually my pockets are already filled with, with skooma. So I'm going to uh, talk to this fellow, actually, see what he's got to say for himself. No, no, no speech options past just selling skooma. Who runs this joint, then? Because this is an amazing setup. Maybe it's just meant to be robbed, then. This person with a hat looks like they're in charge. What have you, huh? Bandit chief. Yes. Nothing. I can't talk to them. I can't, like, do any shipments or anything. Um, that's cool. Speak. I'm going to search these barrels. There's some oh, more moon sugar. How much moon sugar do we need? I don't think we even need any more. There's no point taking any more because we already grow vast amounts. Oh, if I could sell these guys unrefined moon sugar, that would be amazing. I'll take this skewer as well. Look at this. Essence of Sleeping Tree. What does that do? I'm going to inhale some of that myself, actually, to see what that does. Because it, Essence of Sleeping Tree is different to Sleeping Tree Sap. And, oh my. Okay. This is pretty cool. I, I can roll with this. I can roll with this for a while. There's more skooma here. Right, then. Let's head back to the lab. And look about making this Cyril Deluxe Sky Blue quest that we've got now. But before I do that, I'm going to go back to Riften, actually. And I'm going to see if I can mass sell Skooma to those Moon Sugar guys. Because someone in the comments mentioned that I could actually give a large batch of Skooma to those Moon Sugar guys. Um, whether that's true or not, I'm not sure. But I'm going to go check it out anyway. Can't help. It can't hurt to, to try it out. But yeah, this is an amazing setup. I'm so glad we found this lab. Or this den. Uh... This is an amazing set they've got here. It's a shame I didn't know about it sooner. But, you know, it's better late than never, I suppose. With all that, we've got some uh, Balmora Blue as well. I thought we were going to have to craft that, but we've got a free bottle of Balmora Blue, which is the key ingredient in Cyrillic Sky Blue. So, we're well on our way to the good stuff. And the Sleeping Tree Essence has worn off. Let's go. But it's still night time. We weren't in there for too long. I wonder if... I can't quite remember all the ingredients we need for the, the Cyrillic Sky Blue. I think we have most of it. I think there was a few kind of hard to get items. We'll see when we get back to the lab. But I would also like to uh, to hit Riffin up one more time. See about those those Khajiits. So let's go to good old Riften. Yes. All right, here are our good old Khajiit friends. Now, someone did mention that you could possibly sell uh, large quantities. I thought they were only moon sugar salesmen. We've got plenty of moon sugar anyway. So I think I might need to wear my chef's clothes, which I believe I kept. Oh, did I actually store my chef's clothes away? I think I did. I left them at the lab, you know. That's a shame. I'm going to have to go back to the lab and pick those up. Right, I, yeah, I can't talk to these guys without my chef's outfit on because they won't do anything. Right, let's hit the ship back to the lab then. Oh, who are these from? Are these some of these skooma runners? I think these are some of the skooma runners. Yes, they are indeed. Yes. Brilliant. Um, I've got some skooma. Are you interested? I would never touch that swill. Some Balmora Blue. I do have some Balmora Blue, friend, but it's not for you. It's, uh, yeah, that's not for you, friend, I'm afraid. I can't sell that to you. <laughs> I need that for the Cyrillic Sky Blue. Alright, back to the lab we go, then. Wait, make sure I didn't actually sell it to that guy. I want to make sure I've still got that. Yeah, Balmora Blue. 
in my pocket. Very nice. Let's hit the lab up. Right, and uh, oh, there's a dude running over there. I'm always interested about who's knocking about our lab. Dude with a great sword in hand, ready to tussle by the looks of it. Hello, good sir. I'm getting soaking wet coming to you. Are you okay, friend? Is it a bandit explorer? It's a bandit leader. What on earth are they up to? They look aggressive. Ah, oh, they got a band with them. Bandit archer. And a magician. These guys are going to attack the guards by the looks of it. Let's go investigate. And see how this plays out for them. Oh, be careful, friends. You're a pro. Uh oh. That traveler's just going to die. Uh oh. Behind you. <laughs> Watch out. See, these guys don't seem to be attacking them. There we are. Okay, they're not. But they're about to approach the guards. Are they attempting to loot the farm? I think they are. Friends, do not throw your lives away like this. I have skooma. Have some skooma instead. So the guards, the guards come and come after me for the smallest of crimes. But just look at them walking past them. Come on, guards. Pathetic. Oh, they're attacking someone now. What's going on here? I'm getting out of that. This guy can deal with it. This bandit magician. Who are these dudes? The Rift Militia Leader. It looks like the, the, the militia leaders aren't happy. Taking the fight to the waters, are they? My word. Stay away, dog. Oh, that guy's dead. Who's that? Oh, why why do the why are the militia guys after me? Alright, let's get this band out of the water. What have you got in your pockets? Some arrows, some gems, and some stuff. And ow! Ah! I just got me right on the chin. Get out of there. That's it. You take that. Yeah, you're not going to survive this fight, I'm afraid. He's bound to work with me. I'm the lord of the underworld now. Get tased. There we are. Dealt with. Dealt with nicely. What this person was playing at? Militia leader. Thank you, bandits. Thank you. His bodyguard died as well. Right, enough messing around. Let's actually go back to our lab now. And sort, sort the Cyrodiilic sky blue out, shall we? The morning has come. I want to inhale a bottle of Daryl, but I won't until I've made the Cyrodiilic sky blue. Because I don't want to be impaired when making this thing. Right, I wonder what happens after this then, because this is actually a marked quest. So I wonder if our partner's going to want a taste of the, uh, the new stuff. I wonder how much it even sells for. This is the big leagues now. I don't even know how much to charge for, for such a product. But I'm sure our partner will know about it. Let's do this. Right, here goes nothing. We'll warm up first by the fire, because I think we're a bit wet. We're dripping with water and stuff. So where's the fire? Oh, how much did you sell? I sold a bunch of vials, did I? Where's your cut? Uh, 100 septums. Yeah, I, only, I think I only sold like two vials. Uh, that's a cooking. Made some more red water skooma. Oh, thank you. Seven red waters. Very nice. That will come in handy. Let's uh, warm up by the fire, shall we? Sorry, friend. I need to get warm here. There we are. Nice on the coals. There we are. Get nice and warm. There we are. We're nice and warm now. Right. Let me. Let's go check out the Cyrodiilic Sky Blue, shall we? Come on. How much do we need? Right. So, oh, sorry. Southern Guard Sky Blue, not Cyrodiilic. We need Ice Wraith Essence. Three. And uh, three Blue Mountain Flash. We need. We need a few more bits and bobs yet. Perhaps the apothecary has what we're looking for. We have the coin to spend, so we may as well. So all we need is the f uh, purified moon sugar, which we can easily make because we've got plenty of moon sugar. So let's make a bunch of that, shall we? There we are. So all we need now, yeah, is the ice wraith essence and the flower. The apothecary should sell both those things, I think. So if I check my supplies, I get my chef's outfit, and then we'll head back to Riften again. Oh, there we go. It's the pastry chef, not chef. So it's the pastry chef uh, specifically. Right, we have that now. Let's go back to Riften again. And uh, we need the Ice Wraith Essence and a Blue Mountain Flower. If we can't find it at the Apothecary, we'll have to venture out, I think, and uh, find it ourselves. In the north, we'll find an Ice Wraith, I'm pretty sure. Hopefully, we can find what we're looking for. Right then, the guys are right here. So let's put on the pastry chef outfit and talk to them first. Pastry chef's hat, pastry chef's tunic, I think. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> look quite interesting, but let's talk to them anyway. Let's buy some of those sweet rolls. Yeah, that, that's really not a good. That's really not a good price. I thought you could sell. I guess you can't. Back to this guy. Well, I guess you can't. Barrel maybe? No. 
Okay, so I don't know what that was the deal with that was. Someone told me that you could sell mass massive amounts of skewer to them. I guess not. Unless you can and I'm I'm mistaken, I'm doing something wrong. But without further ado, we're here for the apothecary anyway, so let's go. I'm kind of busy. Okay. I, need any potions or ingredients. I do, Be I do indeed. What have you got for sale? Hello. Please have what I'm looking for, I beg of you, please. I've got blue matte and flower. I'll take the lot just in case. An ice wraith, but please. Yeah, no ice wraith essence from this guy. We've got the mountain flowers though, that's fine. Unless he has some, uh, yes, yes, somewhere on his shelf that he's not selling. Which is a possibility. These are just poisons and things. I'm just trying to think of where we can get this ice wraith stuff without actually having to go out into the wilderness and fight one. I would have thought the apothecary would, uh... <gasps> Alchemy chest. It requires a key though. Rip. The rat way. Okay, I'm just trying to think. Maybe we do have to go north, but because I really want to make this this make Southern Guard sky blue this episode. Do, um, nothing here. That's a shame. Let's get out of here. Right, maybe we should just try going as far north as we can. Look for a little bit with sword in hand, and if we have no luck, we'll have to leave it to the next episode or something. But uh, I'm sure we'll find one in no time. So if we go as far north into the tundra as we can, let's see. That's pretty far north. Well, that's towards solitude, though. Uh, we could just go. Yeah, there's there's white there's Windhelm. That's pretty far north. Well, let's go to to Windhelm. See if we can find any around there. Right here we are. Already feeling chilly. Already. That's not good. So hopefully we can find these ice wraiths pretty quickly. Someone do it was too late. Someone do something. What's going on? Oh, who's that on the horseback there? Adventurer. What's going on? Why well, these foemen's attacking me? Am I, wa am I a wanted man here or something? I think I might be a wanted man here in in Windhelm. There's no reason that these bodyguards and stuff should be attacking me in this manner. Stay back, friends. Or foemen. Let's stay away from these guys. Right then. I've got to find these ice wraith teeth pretty quickly. Yeah, I guess I have a bounty. I actually don't know why I have a bounty. Why are these guys attacking me? Because I was on the docks fine, so I think it's just these... These guys, especially. Right, if I lead them to the ice wraith, maybe they can kill each other. Oh, there's wolves as well. And saber cats. This is not good. There we are. Fight each other. Ow. Help me, friends. That's right. Yes. Save me. Oh, that guy's dead. Oh, that guy's dead already. <laughs> Uh-oh. That's it, friend. You better run. You better get out of here, guy. Well, you still can. <laughs> this happens all the time. Every time we travel, we always end up... At the mercy of the beasts and men of the wild. Right, come on. All I need is an ice wraith. Just a single. There's not going to be one around here, is there? Up the mountains, perhaps? Yeah, I think if we go up the mountains, perhaps. All this for a drop of ice wraith essence, huh? The one time you need it. Like, I've killed the ice wraiths and got the essence many a times. I've done nothing with it. The one time you need it. Oh, come on, ice wraith. Come on, I hear some danger. Someone attack me. Wait, who are these guys? These aren't either. Who's that? The Pale Militia? What? Uh, leave me alone from this this craziness. They were fighting someone though. Were they fighting an ice wraith, perhaps? It's just like a militia encampment. Killing a a bandit silver hand. I guess this militia had come to deal with the bandits. Close by, huh? Oh come on, it's gotta be an ice wraith up here. Surely. This militia is still gonna chase us though. They're following fast behind. Oh, there's frost trolls. That's not good. Oh, I saw something up there. I saw like a wisp or something. There's got to be an ice wraith up there. I think I saw one. Oh, the militia is about to fight the trolls by the looks of it. Uh-oh. That's it. You deal with each other. Good. Good. I think the trolls will deal with them pretty swiftly. <laughs> Sorry, militia. But, uh, you've chased the wrong guy. Yes. Ice Wraith, please. There is a guy up there, but it doesn't look like an Ice Wraith. There's a bandit by the looks of it. So probably, probably none up there. So I really want to make this this Southern Guard sky blue. I might have to uh, save it for next episode, which is a real shame. Yeah, I may as well save it for next episode because I don't want to rush it, you know. I'll, uh, I think I'll do the Cyrillic sky blue stuff next episode. And I'll actually go check out these bandits up here because uh, I'm getting really chilly. My cat is getting really cold. 
We need somewhere to warm up anyway. I think these are some bandits up here, which of course bandits are our friends. And that might be why the militia keep attacking us, because we are now known as an underworld kind of boss slash leader. Need something? Yeah, these bandits are totally fine with us. I'm very I'm getting very cold now. Yes. So we really need to get inside because I'm gonna freeze to death. Frostfall is not kind. It's not kind to you. Thank you for giving me reprieve, bandits. I thank you very much. Let's get inside. Oh, this place looks booby trapped. Are the bandits okay doing okay down here? There's a bandit living down down here. Are you sleeping? What's going on down here? Can I use this to warm up, do you think, if I stand close enough? There we are. <laughs> Getting nice and warm. Uh, what is this place? It's a pretty cool place. How many bandits are down here? Yeah, there's more bandits. Warming up. Oh, warming up on the actual steam pipes. That's pretty cool. Very good idea. Yeah, there's a good few yeah. number of bandits down here. We can find reprieve here for a, for a night or two. And the next episode, I think, we'll head out. And get that ice wraith essence fully, fully get. Let me warm up on this little fire here. That'd be nice. Come on, warm your little bones up, my friend. Yes, there we are. Very nice. So yeah, my friends, I think I will leave this episode here. By the next episode, hopefully we can make this Southern Guard sky blue, which is the big, big skooma. I think it's the end game skooma. So uh, we'll see what that does and how much that sells for. It's pretty costly and hard to make though. And yeah, I will leave this episode here for now. My friends, as always, your viewership is always appreciated. If you like what you see, feel free to leave a like. And if you do want to see more, consider subscribing. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.